China just turned one of the deadliest deserts on Earth into a solar power gold mine and accidentally created life where nothing could survive for thousands of years. But here's the twist. Nobody saw what happened next coming. This is the story of how solar panels brought the Gobi Desert back to life. Picture this. The Gobi Desert, 500,000 square miles of absolute nothingness. Temperatures swing from minus 40 to 122 degrees Fahrenheit. For millennia, this place killed everything that tried to live there. But China looked at this wasteland and saw something nobody else did. 3,000 hours of pure sunshine every single year, just going to waste. So in the 2010s, they made a crazy bet. They're going to cover hundreds of square kilometers of dead desert with solar panels. The world called it ambitious. Some called it insane. But what happened next shocked everyone. Within a decade, China built some of the largest solar farms on planet Earth out here. We're talking millions of panels stretching further than you can see. They literally called one the Great Wall of Solar. And yes, it worked. These farms now pump out gigawatts of clean energy, powering cities thousands of miles away like Beijing and Shanghai. But here's where it gets wild. Those solar panels. They accidentally started bringing the desert back to life. The panels created shade, and shade meant the scorching ground wasn't evaporating every drop of moisture anymore. Then something miraculous happened. Grass started growing. Then shrubs appeared. Plants that hadn't existed in these areas for centuries just showed up. Scientists couldn't believe it. They started deliberately planting vegetation under the panels. Farmers brought sheep to graze. The sheep kept the grass trimmed and fertilized the soil naturally. It became this perfect ecosystem nobody planned for. Then people came. Workers needed to maintain millions of panels, so entire towns were built from scratch. Roads connected isolated regions for the first time ever. Families moved in. Schools opened. What was once completely uninhabitable now had communities with actual human life thriving where survival was previously impossible. But before we call this a total win, here's the reality check. These aren't booming cities. The towns are small, life is still harsh, and people are mainly there because of the solar jobs. Not because the desert became some paradise. The moment those panels need less maintenance, those communities could disappear. There's also a darker side. Some environmental scientists worry about what happens when millions of panels eventually need replacing. Will they become a massive waste problem in 20 to 30 years? And the ecosystem improvements, while real, are fragile. Remove the panels and that dessert could reclaim everything